One guy said, 40 from Atlanta, Georgia. Hi, hun. Your profile caught my eyes. I would love to know more about you. Talk about my needs and yours so we can have a better understanding of what we want. Feel free to text me. Another guy, 70, from Mansfield, Ohio, said, Hello, how are you doing today? I'm looking for a father and a child kind of relationship, no strings attached to this. I'm also willing to offer whatever you want as your allowance. You can text me if you don't mind. I hope we can find time so we can get to better know each other. And then literally 26 minutes ago, this guy messaged me. He apparently he's 45 from Mansfield, Ohio. Hey, um, I find you very attractive. I want to be your sugar daddy to take care of you and your financial problems. Mind you, I've only had this uh, account for less than 12 hours already. So, happy Thanksgiving. Okay, it is currently Thanksgiving at the time of me filming this video. And as you can see in the title of this video, I signed up for a dating website. Yay, me! But it's not just a regular dating website. It is a special dating website. Oh, uh -huh. It's a dating website for sugar babies and sugar daddies or sugar mamas. Now, you all know I'm gay. So, I'm looking for a sugar daddy, I guess. Um, but to me, the way I'm looking at it, it's like, it's more of a higher caliber of dating for me. You know, I've been dating for a while now and nothing serious has come about anything. And I've dated a ton of guys and... I've just gotten to a point in my life, in my love life, where I want something a bit more serious. So I made a seeking, seeking Arrangements profile, you all. So what Seeking Arrangements is, and I'm still new to this jargon of it all and what it all actually is and what it all means. But what Seeking Arrangements is... So Seeking Arrangements is a dating website where um, money talks, basically. And, you know, Seeking Arrangements is a good way to find a person with um, a generous resource of financial means, I guess is a professional way of saying it, I guess. Um, you know, it's a good way to look for people that have money, basically. Um, dating with a purpose, kind of. Seeking Arrangements is pretty much a dating website where you, you're either a sugar baby or you're a sugar mama or a sugar daddy or sugar whatever. Um, and it's not necessarily a website where you actually have to date people per se or like, you know, do sexual things per se. Apparently there are people on the website who will actually just pay you an allowance just to have you in their life, I guess, or, I don't know, the whole thing is new to me, honestly, uh, you know, but I've had a lot of friends and people tell me, you should get on Seeking Arrangements, you should get on Seeking Arrangements, and I had one when I was younger, but I didn't really know what I was doing, I didn't really know what to expect, and when I was younger, I kind of had this thing where, I don't need no man, like, you know, I'm a strong black woman, I'm still a strong black woman, but, you know, with this whole dating thing, it's just... You know, I don't know. Dating at this stage of the game, I, like, I need to get more serious about it. And um, guys my age don't necessarily, not all guys my age, but most guys my age don't necessarily have the financial means of supporting the life I want. Now, mind you, I'm not a gold digger by any means. I have my own money. But it's not fun necessarily to go out with a guy and like you like the date you go to is like a date to McDonald's or like Burger King or Eating In or something like that. I want to go out on dates that are more lavish and I just want a more luxurious and lavish life. I want experience. I want meaning. I want dating with purpose. I want honestly a guy who loves me more than I love him. And this is why I'm thinking Seeking Arrangements is, like, the better decision for me. Now, obviously, you can tell that many people have been messaging me. And mind you, my profile picture hasn't even been approved yet. So, Lord only knows that when my profile picture is approved, because I'm not saying I'm ugly, but I'm, I'm, 
I'm attractive, all right, um, that more people are going to come in. And with me, when it comes to dating, I'm not necessarily someone that jumps in really quickly. I like to get to know people first. You know, I like to go on a few dates before we make things official, obviously. Maybe even date a few months before we make things official. So, um, but I'm all about dating with a purpose. And I've actually heard a lot of stories about people getting on seeking arrangements and you know, kind of meeting some amazing people, meeting some amazing people that, you know, support you and that love you through showing effort and, and attention. And that's just something I've never really had in my dating life. So I'm opening myself up to seeking an arrangement in some way, I guess. Um, but it's funny seeking arrangements. Like, I, like, do wonder about, like, the original purpose of seeking arrangements. Was it always a sugar baby, sugar daddy, mama kind of situation? Or was it really made for the purposes of seeking arranged marriages or something like that? My metaphysical mind is popping in, so I'm gonna tuck that away and kind of, you know, put that away for now. But, yeah, I'm on seeking arrangements. And, um... We'll see how it goes. All right. I have an account. My account name is... I don't know if I want to say my account name because I don't know if people can look me up. But, um... But, um, it's like... I don't know. My friend helped me with my, like, um, profile. So, I think my profile name is, like, Dreamy Boy or something like that. And my description, I just basically talk about, like, how, you know, I'm looking for a man who's generous and who is experience-oriented and who, you know, is able to fill my sweet tooth. I am a sugar baby, for goodness sakes. So if you girls or guys have any tips about being a sugar baby, being on this website, definitely give me some tips in terms of what I should be looking out for. It's, like, a really interesting website, you know? Like, you can, like, even set the amount of what you... Or, I guess, willing to accept in terms of money. Like, this guy has to be... Has to have this net worth. He has to be making this much money each month. It's a little superficial for my taste. But I am superficial a little bit. I mean, I am a moon in Libra. So... But, like, I don't really have my, like... I don't have, like, he needs to make this much money. I don't have that set up on my website yet. I'm more so about, like, feeling the person out. And more, like, an, an, an individual, you know basis and one-on-one -on -one basis i need to see what your personality is and stuff like that so i don't know it'll be really really interesting maybe i'll meet you know a rich white man or a rich latino man a rich middle eastern man a rich black man maybe i don't know but you know it's it's very very interesting um most of the guys who have hit me up so far have been white <laughs> and have been latino all right the older men that have hit me up but i can't like uh, it's only, I've literally only been on this website for 12 hours, so I'm interested to see how things, you know, go moving forward. But yeah, I'm on Seeking Arrangements, so if you guys have any tips and tricks, um, I don't know many people personally in my, like, day-to-day -day life that have actually used the website and found success, but I've literally had so many people like i had a friend last night we talked about it and she convinced me to have some stars by the way check her out on youtube um she convinced me to get like to go on the website <clears throat> but people have been telling me for years like i had a guy friend tell me like you should get on seeking arrangements like you could you could find a sugar daddy like that like you know like what are you waiting for and it just like it was such a like a foreign concept to me like a man giving me money and funding my life without me having to necessarily do anything. Assuming that we've arranged that dynamic to actually, you know, be what's taking place. It's a very interesting, you know, concept to me. But you guys have also mentioned to me, you know, in my chats and stuff. And, you know, a lot of my followers that I hold close to me. And I hold some of you closer to me than others, no offense. You guys have told me that I need someone who is more seasoned in life, who's older, you know, who clearly has money. I'm a Capricorn, Virgo, rising, Libra, moon. So, you know, money and having your own is a big thing to me. 
but also you know older people are people that you can learn from and i see you know a, a, a good sugar daddy as not just being someone that financially supports you but just supports you in life like helps you to overcome you know certain things that you know you deal with you know in your 20s or 30s or whatever um kind of maybe mentors you in a way like shows you the finer side of life like you know like just a man being there like i think that's what i'm really looking for is just a man to be there for me mind you i have some daddy issues a little bit my dad died when i was 18 all right so that's also something that was a little weird to me was like am i looking for a daddy like a father or am i looking for what am i like what am i looking for so this is all brand new to me um and i'm excited to see what lies ahead um i don't know we'll see if i find like a rich you know older man you know that will be my sugar daddy i don't know if i would actually ever tell you guys you know maybe i'll hint at it but it depends on the arrangement that we have, right? Um, but I'm not into, like, being a whore, like, prostituting myself or anything like that. Like, that's not something I'm interested in. But I'm just interested to see what, you know, lies ahead. I've heard some amazing stories about people meeting, like, some really prominent people actually on Seeking Arrangements. So, we'll see what happens. Um... But yeah, cheers to me. And it's funny, now that I'm on the site, like, boys my age just seem so less irrelevant to me. Like, or so much more irrelevant to me. I'm just like, are you on Seeking Arrangements? Alright, I love you guys. This is really, really all I have to report so far. Also, today, it, at the timing of me making this video, it is Thanksgiving. So once again, happy Thanksgiving if you celebrate that. What am I thankful for this year? You know, I'm thankful for you all. I'm thankful for my YouTube channel. I'm thankful for growth and healing. And I'm thankful for my health. I'm thankful for my bank account. You know, just what I've made on my own. Um, by the way, I don't have a sugar daddy. I've never really had, I've never had a sugar daddy actually. So this is really all brand new to me. Um, and I'm thankful for God, really. You know, that's what I'm thankful for this year. My family, my cat. Even though he gets on my nerves. My home. Even though that gets on my nerves sometimes. But, you know, life is good. And I feel like it's only up from here. So, this is my Seeking Arrangements story. If you have used Seeking Arrangements. If you have had success with Seeking Arrangements. Definitely let me know your tips and tricks. I would be interested to find that out. You can comment me. You can message me on Instagram or whatever. But, yeah. So, once again, if you would be interested in a personal reading from me, I am a psychic tarot reader as well as an astrologer. So, check out my website, lamartownsintero.com, to get a reading from me. You can also contact me on my website or my uh, through my phone number, 703-791-9162. It is my business phone, okay? Um, so, only call for business, all right? Uh, me, aka only call if you want a reading okay i do birth chart readings i have a special right now it's a new year special you get uh one candle a 30 minute recorded psychic tarot reading and a 30 minute recorded birth chart reading all for a hundred dollars all right so check those out on my website follow me on my social media lamar townsend tarot on instagram and facebook and um i am well aware that also with the seeking arrangement things you have to be careful of scams don't give your bank account bank account information and stuff like that um and yeah we'll see what lies ahead you guys all right and girls i love you all thank you for listening and watching and happy thanksgiving happy new year and I'll see you in the next video. Otherwise, I'll see you for your own personal reading. Either way, I will see you. Love you.